coach, you knew coming here was a very good football team. And today, where you had to minimize the mistakes and take the chance of opportunities that were presented, came up on the short end today. Yeah, it's like when you play good football teams, as we said before we went on air, the, the room for air is very, very small. Um, and at the end of the day, if you don't win any phase of a football game, you're not going to win the game. You know, the fact is we didn't tackle well enough on defense. We still didn't help ourselves on special teams. And we got consumed with the line of scrimmage, specifically when Goose went out. And we talked last week about just so many young kids getting their first college experience in the football game at home against Nevada last week. To your point, what you just said, it didn't help. Eli was out on the offensive line today. Not making excuses, it is what it is. He was out today, then Goose goes out late in the, in the first half, so you just kind of had to work with what you had there the rest of the football game. Yeah, you're fighting uphill when a starting center and starting quarterback are out of the game already. Um, and then you're playing a fine football program that's put together a great resources and a great environment and great support. Um, and they have great players and coaches. So um, no surprises there, but you're fighting uphill when those things happen, unfortunately. And they put us in space on uh, their offense to our defense, and it put us in a very difficult position to tackle. What would you think about Matthew's performance once coming in and playing the second half of the football game for you? Well, that's why you have to prepare the right way, because you never know when. Yep. And it happened to him, and certainly proud of how he responded. We operated well. I thought he managed the huddle well, got us in and out of plays very well, and did some things really good. Of course, there's plenty to fix and improve, but I was proud of what he did and how he led, and he looked prepared coming onto the field. So the task doesn't get any easier. Another road game, Big Ten opponent at Iowa next week. Um, very good football team, um, very tough environment to play in back on the road next week. Yeah, they don't. it doesn't get easier. It's never going to, um, especially with the young football team we have. So we got to lick our wounds. We got a long ride home. Um, We'll figure it out on the way home and try to find a way to patch ourselves up, get the thing back together, and get a good plan on Sunday and get our guys out there Monday and go back to work. All right, Coach, thanks for joining us, and we'll see you next week. Thank you.